Hi everyone! In this video, I'm going to show you how to add a pop-up to your website. A pop-up is a light box that appears over your content and is a great way to grab attention, get more sales, and capture leads or client information. To add a pop-up, go to Marketing and SEO, and under Promotional Tools, just click Pop-up. Now you'll see this light box that explains what a pop-up is, and just click Make Pop-up to make one. So you'll see that you can preview how the pop-up looks right here. And before we go ahead and customize the pop-up style and content, I'm going to go over the display settings first. You can choose to have the pop-up appear automatically, or just create it first, and then add a link to your pop-up on your website. So I'm going to choose to have my pop-up appear automatically. So where it says Auto Display Pop-up on Pages, I'll toggle that on. Now you can choose which pages you want the pop-up to appear on. You can click Edit right here. I would like the pop-up to appear no matter which page the visitor first lands on, so I'll leave it at all pages. Now I can choose the pop-up delay, which is how much time the visitor will need to spend on the page before the pop-up will appear. It may be a good idea to let visitors see your content and get oriented with your website first before having the pop-up appear. I'm going to choose to set the pop-up delay to 5 seconds, so that gives the visitor a bit of time to settle on the page. Just click and drag. Now, automatic pop-ups are a great way to grab attention and inform visitors right away of something that may catch their interest. But the last thing you want to do is annoy your visitors or make the user experience so uncomfortable that they leave your page. That's why limiting the automatic pop-up display to show only once per time period is a good idea. You can enter your own custom time period based on your audience and your preferences. I'm going to keep the pop-up limited to show only once every 24 hours within a visitor's browser session. Before I customize the content, I'm going to quickly click Change Colors and Layout and then click Change Design. This is where you can change the style of the overall pop-up, but I'm going to stick with the default one, so I'll click Back. And I'll keep the rest of the layout the same, so I'll go back again. So now we can go ahead and edit the pop-up media and content. So we've scrolled down on the left, and you can customize the pop-up just like you can customize any page section. For the image, we can click Upload and Change or Select from Files. So you'll probably want to upload your own images for a pop-up, but you can also go and explore the stock images. You can change your title and your subtitle. I'll also change the description. So I'm going to add a link for my primary button. I'll just link that to my shop page. and then I'll turn off the secondary button. Now for business standard and business advanced plans, you can add a contact form to your pop-up. This is a valuable tool because it's a great way to capture leads for potential clients. I'm gonna add a form just by turning the toggle on. And we can go ahead and add more form fields. So you can click on it right here and add form field or just do it on the left. For email, I'm going to keep that as a required field. Now I'm going to add a name field. And I'm going to make this field not required. And when that field is selected, I'll just click on the arrow so that that's the first field. And I've rearranged that order. So now my pop-up is complete. One more thing I'm going to do is show you how to add this pop-up as a link so that visitors can trigger the pop-up by clicking the button or the link. So I'll just close the pop-up view here. So I'm just going to go to my FAQ page. I'll 
I'll change some of the text here. And now that I've added this text, I want to make sign up this text right here. I want to add a link. So I'll highlight that and click link to. And then I'll choose pop up. So now that that's selected, I'll click save. So we can go to the preview to see what that looks like. Now we'll click the pop up and you'll see that this light box appears. So to make sure everything goes live, once you're ready, make sure you publish your website. Click publish in the top right. And that's it. So that's it for this video. We hope that you try out adding a pop-up to your website and it can help you get more sales and capture leads. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and thanks so much for watching.